Oi, oi, guys. Um, so, taking our rights back here. I'm also out with natural born serial killer. Trying to see what happened to him, yeah. I know, I'm, I know we've lived free, they've definitely um, missed you section 50 at least twice that I know of. I got approached there. Yeah. Here we go. Well, are you alright? Yes, thank you. Will can you stay you will you stay back please? Right. Can I ask you why you're filming it? Officers going in and out of the station. Pardon? I can't hear you. I'm asking why you're filming officers coming in and out of the station. Do you know because you you you're a bit further back? Can you take your mask down so I can I can't hear you? I'm just asking why, what's the reason for you to film in officers coming out and in? Oh, what am I filming for? Yeah. All oh, right, I'm making a documentary. Um, first of all, can you identify yourself? Because I can't see no yeah, numbers. Yeah. Can number you say it for me? I it's 1933. 1933? Yeah. And can I take your name, please? It's uh, PC Kuprevich. Bloody hell, man. How are you, man? It's COVID-19. Do you need to come that close? Yeah, what are you doing? Do you need to come that close, doing? officer? What are you doing? I was talking to that gentleman. Can I ask you a question? No, right, I'm going to ask you your details now. What's right. your name? Am I breaking the law? I just told you. It's a security risk. You pack it in filming. I'm going to take your details. We're going to do some checks on you to make sure you're not. Not taking my risk. details. Well, we are. We've got a power to do that, young man. So. And what? And what power would that be? Have I broke the law? Section one of pace. We want to make sure you've got Section nothing on one. you here that's going to harm us or anybody else. And that's the reasons why you may be filming this, this police station for security reasons. You may be a terrorist. You may well, be if you didn't speak up on me like that, you'd have heard me explaining to 1933 what I was doing. I was just about to explain, on, and then. you scared me by coming that close. What are you doing? It's COVID-19, and what you, you shouldn't be that close. Will you stand back a bit, please? I've got a face mask me, on. Uh, it's not a problem, is it? A face mask doesn't doesn't it's actually. Away, isn't it? So what's the problem? No, it's supposed to be told me. It's it's about my health. No, I'm explaining. Uh, right. I, I want to talk to him because I don't like the way. I'm losing my rag because you're not but listening to what I'm explaining. I suggest you don't lose okay. your rag. You are outside a police station. Police you're police not. Yeah. You you're you not like. Unless I've broke the law, you were taking no details from me, officer. Why can't we not film because like everyone films? And I'm, I don't care if you're a PC, inspector, superintendent, you were not taking my details. We'll get somebody else to come down. Yeah, but we need to check right. If we do it by force, we'll do it by force. Under what grounds? Just told you, section one of police can search for that. So you're making, you you're making, you're making it up as we go along then. So it's, it's pit. It's pit. All right. Pardon? Oh, you don't need. I don't need permission, brother. Listen, I'm going to roll back the phone. I'm going to take it from you. You're going to take what? This phone from I bet you don't. I bet you don't. I bet you don't now. I'll bet you any money you can't take that. Right. Right. If I give you permission, I don't know if I have to film you. Don't film listen, me. listen. Do you want to educate me? Do you want me to educate you? You're in public. You've got no expectation of privacy. Me. Yeah. You're filming me. You yeah, you're in public. Do you know what? Hey, I'll get. I'll... Don't film me, yeah? Don't film me. Film on you? I don't need permission, brother. For me. For you? Looks as us for us, guys. Oh, I'm closer out than think. I've got all the evidence, yeah, my mate. They can form what they want. I've got it on evidence. That's absolutely fair, yeah. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, he's lucky yeah. that I'm not even going to. I could press charges against him, couldn't I? Huh? And choice. I've got the evidence, couldn't I? Yeah, choice. So I could press charges. Have you read that, mate? I can't press charges, you know. Just want to educate him, mate, that's all. I can't press charges, so you're lucky, aren't you? Come off the road, fella. I'm all right. I can, don't worry about my right. safety. No, no, no. Mate. Well, I have to. I don't want to get run over on the road. No, but I'm, I'm, I, I, I won't get run over, mate. Right. I've been crossing roads right. all my life, man. Great. Am I okay to take your name and address, matey? What for? Have I committed a crime? No, but no, they've, then. they've reported. Yeah, they've like reported. Being very abusive, so at this moment in time. Right. Just to clarify, this couple like, comes out from Okay. Right. Right. Do I have to? Then I'm not right. going to do that then. I'm not going to do that, mate. But I could phone and say that they've been very abusive, so couldn't I? Station and all this, you know. Any police station in the world, man, in the land. I think, mate. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's a fact. 
Do you know what, mate? I respect you. You, mate. I don't even want to talk to you. Because what it is, you defaced our flag. My granddad fought for that flag, right, mate. Okay, no bother. Um, Are you going to take it off for me, then? Are you going to identify yourself, first of all, please? 2731. I didn't, I didn't say 273. Thank yeah. you. Okay. Are What's you going to take name? that flag off, please? What's your name? I don't want to give you my name. I haven't done nothing right, so wrong. you're not giving me details? No. Right. Why? Why do I need no more? I'm asking you details. Yeah, but do I have to? I'm asking you, do I have I'm, to? I'm asking you for your details, yeah. Well, I have to. By law, I have to give you my details. Are, are you going to provide me your details? I'm asking you, do I have to? I want to know, do I have yeah, to I'm first? I'm asking your details because you've been involved in an altercation. Right? I haven't been involved in any altercation, right. like. I haven't. I haven't, yeah. mate. I've got it all on video, mate. Right, that's fine. All on video. Okay. But... Right, at this time, you're under arrest. Are we then? Just get that phone off me, please. Hey, let me turn it off, mate. Let me turn it off. Okay, Put you do. In. Um, the front reception and let them know that uh, so guys I was she was saying I'm going to take a and all. I was going to pretend and that uh, I thought you could take <laughs> right didn't back get that. I the area to put it on today. hello hey, miss you live and you learn let's go are you good are you alright miss could I take your number please miss Why? your number because it's in your policy <laughs> Three seven four six is that, Miss? Because I'm a bit dyslexic. That's all, Miss. That's alright. Why do you want my number? Because it's your policy to identify sort of members of the public right. when asked. Are you recording there, Miss? I am recording, just like you're recording me. Yeah, but I haven't got a policy where I've got to inform you, Miss. You were supposed to inform me that you're recording, or if you can't at the time, then re then inform me at the earliest I opportunity. Just have, I've just informed you of my recording. Just Only because I asked you. I just want to know what you guys are doing recording in front of the police well, station. Well, Miss, where, first, can I ask you a question, please? Right. Are we breaking the law, Miss? You're not breaking the law. So, therefore, I don't need to give you an explanation then, do I, Miss? That's fine, but I just think it's a bit disrespectful you're going around recording people on police property. Well, unfortunately, Miss, that's the, the, in these uh, current climates, Miss, that's what happens in society today and because. The reasoning behind this is? Again, I don't have to tell you that, Miss. Because I want to, All just right, because I'd fine. like to. Well, then you keep wasting your time recording. Okay, then. Okay. As long as you just keep doing your job and don't brutalise anyone out there, miss. Don't do but what? Brutalise members brutalize. of the public. Yeah, brutalise members of the I public. I hope not, miss. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not saying polite. you haven't been polite, miss. Right, well, I, I you're hope. Antagonizing me. No, I'm not That's antagonising you, miss. You, you engage me in conversation, miss. I'm no, just no, saying, please don't. Please don't. Please don't uh, brutalise any members of the public, that's all I said, miss. Not trying to antagonise you, miss. Just uh, out here performing a lawful activity, miss. That's all we're doing. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take your name. You're going to take my name? Yes. Why? It's a legal requirement. But... Uh, what? So do I have to, do I have to, miss? Legal requirement. What do you mean by legal? Name. What do you mean by legal requirement? Oh, look at this, guys. There's no, there's no problems here, guys. There's no problem here, you know. You don't have to come out here mob, mob handed like that. Shall I address you by Sergeant McAllister? Sergeant McAllister like. Smith. No, no. Bacon Sergeant chops. Sergeant. So anything I like. Bacon chops then. Yeah, can I just ask what you're doing outside? That's all. Just a lawful activity, sir. Okay, that's fine. He's doing something like you're you look a bit. You look a bit pissed off, you there, man. You're keeping your language. I'm absolutely fine. Language. What language is that? There's no members of the public. You can't be offended. You can't be offended. Can you you can't be offended. Oh, where? Can you see in the office? In the office? Well, yeah. I can't hear you, mate, can I? They can't hear you, mate, man. man. They're indoors, man. Don't, don't try and twist the law, mate. That's why we're here, because of people like you who broke large members of the public. Right. That's why we're here today, because of officers like you. You shouldn't be in that uniform if you're going to misuse your powers, sir. Nobody's well, he's just trying to, oh, hasn't he? Question. He's telling me there's members of the public in there. Well, all windows. All win but when you get officers like this who think the tyrants and they think they can well, bully okay. members well, of the public. Well, like be, okay. it, was a, it was a bit tyrant. He was nice, like. Nice to meet you anyway. Right. So see you later. Thank you. See you later, Mr. Bacon Chops. Nice. Not you, nice. Sarge. Sarge, you were class young man. Yeah. You know you know to communicate, Sarge. But when you've got bacon chops over there telling me there's pub nothing on the wards is happening. Nothing on the wards is happening. Yeah, it's boiling, isn't it? The climate. It's boiling and all. Love it. Yeah. Well, I did try to explain to the lady on the desk. Do you want to identify yourself, please? Yeah, you can, film your, you can film out here, but you can't come inside the police station. Pardon? My number's on display. I'm dyslexic.
It's all right. Just two nine four one. Two six seven eight. Thank you. You can come. You can film that here. Look as you look as all. You you seem all right, you. Do you know what? I was just checking you out there to see if you had that union jack on. I mean, I think you've got a bit of a bad attitude, if I'm honest. No, I don't think he has. Right, so you can film it. Cabinet doesn't lie, you know, guys. You can't go inside, mate. Of course you can. It's no, a public building. Not inside, it's not. It's not public. Not inside. It is. That's a public it's foyer. Public out here. Public foyer you under section in... under section no. 33, right, of the Criminal Justice Act 1972. Mm -hmm. I am here to. Exercise my yeah, right, and I'm telling you, I'm yeah. telling you, officer, yeah. under section 33, yeah. 1972 of the Criminal Justice Act, tells me I can go in there because it's public. All right, yeah, no worries, but you can't feel So, me your authority, doing. what you think you've got, doesn't trump my right. So, right. Is, there yeah. any, is there any reason you want it to It doesn't. Provoke, provoke Wait there, I'm talking. I'm ta I don't want a reaction. Do you know what? If, if I'm on it, I don't think you're are, are you? Ah, uh, on behalf. On behalf oh, mate, it doesn't work like that. Yes. You've come across people who know the law. So, I'm going to walk in there and you can arrest me and do what you want, and then I'll take you to court for it, you know. Take us to Cleve, what? and then I'll take you right <coughs> Cleveland Place because mm -hmm. you were representing Cleveland Place. So I'll be taking Cleveland Place to court because case number two that would be right. And then and then I'll take you to court personally, right, for their public redress. How would you like that? How would you like them apples? What's your name? My name's none of your business. Well, it is. Well, it's not. Well, it is. Well, it's not. Why is it then? Tell me why. What do you want my details for? Well, why do you want to film me? Huh? Because oh, film me? I didn't want to film you. Out? You come Why? out, you approached me. You filmed me in a police station, so you're a security threat. A security threat? Are we going yeah. down section 43? Be careful, you know, because I will have you. I will have you. I swear to God, I'll have you, man. I'll have you. Mm -hmm. Lawful redress, personally. And I'll have Cleveland Police, all you're representing as well. Please, I'm telling you. So just be careful what eggshells you're cracking. Okay. Okay. Are you finished, guys? Not really. I'm coming in there. You're not. I am. You're not. I am. You're not. I bet you're do. Will you come in here and I'll arrest you? For what? For trespass. For trespass. Yeah. Trespass, right? I've told you you're not. Trespass you is, you're not is civil for one. Yeah. So how can you? Yeah. How can? How can you? How can you? How can you arrest me for for trespass? It's civil. Well, if you don't. Boom, boom, boom! He knows that one as well. Unlucky. What's your details, then? Oh, details. guys, look at him. What details? Look at the way he goes off. All right, then, I'll tell you what, then. What do you want my details for? Oh, I don't understand what do you want my details for? Sure you huh? you do you think I'd be stood outside the police station if I was wanted? Well, possibly, yeah. uh, Well, you haven't committed a crime, so you're not getting them? How would you like them apples? Well, how do I know you've not committed a crime? Do you suspect I have? Be careful, you know. Be careful. You guys have got absolutely nothing better You might need to be no. careful. No. Uh, I'm always careful, me, mate. Good. Good. I'm always careful. I set out with the intention of not to break the law so and sir, stay within the boundaries the of the law. I'm always careful. And I sir. tell him he's a clown. Seems like what? Waste of time, really. Does it? Mm -hmm. Do you know what would have been a waste of time if you didn't come out and fucking try and brutalise us, man, with right, your lies? Swearing. swearing. There's, there's no public, guys. There's no public. There's no public, guys. No public. Go for it. Lock me up, then. just told us it's a public area. Lock me up. There's no public, though. There's no public, though, is there? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. He's lying, mate. Well, I'm not lying at all, mate. He's, He's lying. lying. You've, just, you've just, you've just said you want to come in there because it's public. Yeah, and but then now you're telling us it's not a public area. I didn't say it's not a public area. I said there's no members of public. Doesn't not only is there not, there's no one, there's no, there's no, there's no complaint. The anyone complaining? Have is there anyone complaining? Me. Are you? I'm a member of the public. You can't public. be offended, mate. You're in that uniform, you're in fancy dress. I'm a member Unlucky. of the public. Unlucky. Unlucky again. Unlucky. You cannot. He cannot. And he cannot be offended. Get on that one. Get on. Get on that one. No, you're not. Not I when you're in that fancy dress. You're not. No, you're not, man. You're a clown. When you're in that, you're a clown. That's what you are. All right. That's what you are, clown. Yeah, yeah. How do you like them? That's Apples? That's fine. Or, do, that or should, we change, should we change it up a bit? Some pears now. If you want to. Do you want yeah. some pears? Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, are we then? Let's see what other, other BS. Because uh, I'm not even, even if I do swear, you can't lock me up. Okay, and again, right? Like I'll, 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 no, you can't. You can't. There has to be a complaint, and for one, and there is no members of the public, so how can you? So, so you're telling me there's a public area? Yeah. yeah. Right, so why can't I go in there? So why can't I go in there? Are we there not? So why can't I go in there? Is, is that a public area in there? That's a, that's a police station, mate. Is it a public so, area? Really, you've, you've turned is that for you there, public? Like, to wrong... a reaction from police officers. Not really. Not done. really. I was going to tell you, but you said... All this area belongs to Cleveland Police, so I'm asking you to leave now. Unlucky, man. I'm asking you to leave. I'm saying no. Well, it's open to public on 
certain exceptions. Right. And obviously, we've withdrawn. Section 33. Yeah, Section 33. I'll repeat it again for you. I will take you to court, you know. I will take you to court, and I promise you that. I promise you. I'm looking you in the eye. I will talk, take you to court. For what? Right. For what? Carry on, do what you've got to do, and then we'll decide from there, won't we? Right, so you don't uh, know the But I don't need to go, don't I? Don't I? It depends, it depends, it depends what, it depends what powers you want to misuse, doesn't it? Today, it depends what powers you want to misuse today. I'm telling you, you misuse any, any of your powers. And I will take Cleveland Police for the second time, right, to court. Right, and then I'll come after you personally, or whichever one of you, all three years anyway, for uh, lawful so redress. For him? lawful, no, no, I will take us to court if you, if you, any one of you, right, and if you do it, and he, and he allows you, or he, I'll take all three of you. That's fine. All three is not a threat. That's a promise, man. Promise. Are you finished now? I'm just getting started, if I'm honest. Okay. Right, well, I've asked you, I've asked you to leave. See, if you'd have come and approached us properly, right? I've asked you to leave. Are you if you'd have come, if you... And plus, if it was private property, sir, that so is guys, a civil matter, you know. It's a civil matter, a sir. Oh, oh, look, at, he's got to get some police officers down. We didn't want this, man. Uh, I'm trying to put North Humber, right, please, audible. in a good light. Uh, so and now it's going to end up going bad now. Why does it have to be? Look at him all these. Listen, just for you, because you're all in your head. I don't want to create your own headache. I'll be outside when you get your colleagues. This is private property. I've just seen on the door there, right, just for your information, that it's a put, which I already knew. A police stations are public, um, but it says on the door it says public reception. Are you up? Just keep your miss, please keep your distance. So there's coronavirus, please keep your distance. I, I haven't caused come, uh, come to cause any trouble, miss. Please let me speak. Yeah, but you're not listening. You can't I'm listening. Media. I'm listening, miss. It doesn't the can't? No such thing as can't. What it says up there. Please do not film with the Please don't know. That's a request. Uh -huh. I don't do requests. But you would have to stop filming, you would have to leave the building. Well, do you want to come outside and have a conversation right. then? Come on yeah. then. Are you coming, sir? Come on then. Can you identify yourself, miss? Because you haven't got no numbers on your shoulder. I have got numbers on your shoulder. All right. Well, will you identify yourself, please? Because I can't see them. And I'm dyslexic, miss. I'm 1923. dyslexic. 1923. 1923. You weren't born in 1923, surely. What's a, what, what's a crack? Mine's 3437, mate. I hope you haven't got no crack on you, man. It's illegal to have what's, crack. What are you, what are you doing well, what, what I'm doing here, miss? Do you mind if I call you up with PC? McGinley. McGinley. PC McGinley and... Kritzak. Say that again? Kritzak. 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 PC Kritzak. Is that Polish? Polish? It is, I. So how are you? <laughs> Got a Polish partner, see? Um, so, yeah. What it, well, grandparents are Polish. Um, what I'm in the area for, miss, is I've come to take some footage, really. Um, if you like, I've come to flex my rights, basically. Right. Um, exercise my rights. Nothing more, nothing less. I don't want to cause no problems. Um, that's it, really. Right, but as far as saying that, I mean, look at that on the door. Under Section 33 of the Criminal Justice Act, 1972, Miss, right? It's publicly accessible. Yeah? Do we agree on that? It's a public building anyway, paid by the taxpayer, by me and you. Got me work boots on, look. Um, by me and the likes of you. I can go in there and I can film. It's can't not film. of course I can. So what it. under what law can I film, miss? You can't film it if we spilled it. You're making a bold, a bold statement there, miss. You're not filming if we spilled it. Well, of course document. I can. I've been. You want a, a document for it? A document. You Listen. stay there and I'll get you a well, document. I want to tell you this then. When you, you come back, don't there. point at me like that, miss. That's very rude. I'm not going to be rude to you unless you're rude to me and then you'll get it back. Pardon. What was your name, sorry? My name? Yeah. What would you like my name for? Just so I can call you by name. Just call me sir. Sir. Okay, that's fine. Okay, thank you. She was very rude there, wasn't she pointing? Well, I wouldn't say so, but... So if I start I, I pointing know. at you, would that, would you... You can feel, you can feel free to do what I'm not rude, mate, sir. I, I like to try and that's be absolute. civil. You know, like I said, People. I'm just flexing my rights. I know, I understand. I know, I know you said you're flexing your rights. And uh, you said that... You know, you're not being rude or anything like that. I'm not saying you are. Aye. But and I don't expect a police officer, especially in uniform, to be rude to me neither. But I wouldn't say she was being rude. Well, I point you, I know you're just flexing your right. Aye. I know, you, I know you're here to make a statement, right? And I understand what you're doing. Aye. Like you, everyone's seen it all over YouTube. And Aye. I know, what, I know what your crack is. Aye. No, I'm not on crack. I'm not on drugs, man. <laughs> you, know, I'm, you know I don't mean it that way. Aye. Don't you? Okay. Right. So, obviously, I'm just going to wait for her to come back and... Aye. So but you can give me what document she doesn't come back with no documentation. I've got documentation, you know. I've what's got documentation for you. What's your name? My name? What do you want my name for? I just so I don't know who you are. Just call me sir. I'm not calling you sir. 
Well, just don't call me anything then. All right. So what are you going to do? Yeah, you haven't got a problem with calling me, sir. I don't have a problem with anything, but I'm not calling you, sir. Um, so are you just staying here? I'm going to flex my right and if I want to go back in there and record, I'm going to. And there's nothing you can do about it. You're just being a nuisance, though, to cause disturbance. No, 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 no. Uh, do you know what, right? I haven't come to cause any trouble with you, right? That's not... Listen, right, we need a police force. But what we need, right, is we need a police force that's willing to do things properly. And you by to you telling me and pointing at me like that when you went in the doors. Why? Not properly. Yeah. Well, I'm telling you, if you hold your horses and slow down, I will tell you, miss. You? I'll tell you, miss. I'll tell you, if you slow down, right, you, when you went in that door, you were pointing at me like that. Now, I am pointing at you. I've been quite civil, I think. Um, I'm pointing at people, it's quite road mess. You're in a uniform, you should be remaining professional. Now, why am I here? Right, as I'm here to flex my rights to the fullest of my ability, um, and that is exactly what I intend to do. Unless I break the law, then I expect to be left alone. And me going in that building there, what says on that door there, right, is public uh, reception, right? And I can go in there and record. And if I go in there and record, right, and you don't like it, that's unlucky mess. What it is, I. I I follow um, common law, is what I follow, right? So why are you here though? Like why, why have you well, decided I'm, to come I've, and I've down just and told you. Cause, yeah, cause, but why, why? Because I want to. But it's just we, like me and him have jobs to do and now we're standing talking to you about this when we But I didn't, I didn't ask you to. I didn't ask you to. Yeah, but you're causing the nuisance in there. A nuisance? I was talking to this police staff, I was having yeah, a civil conversation. He was sat there doing that when I walked in. It, the, the, this, do you know what this? This why we have this is it's an independent witness and it doesn't lie, man. Like police officers do. Mm -hmm. Like police officers do. And you so coming like out? How long are you planning on standing here for? Let, all day? As long as I want. I'd have probably been gone now if you didn't come out, miss. Right, well, you just go now then. Well, I can do what I want, can't I? Huh? Again, you're being rude, miss, and I will go to professional standards about you if you carry on being rude I'm like that. Really I strongly good. suggest that you start being polite like I'm being polite don't to you. Tell me what to do. Well, you don't tell me what to do now, so if I want to come in there and video it, I will, so don't you tell me what to do. It works both ways, doesn't it, miss? Huh? See? If you want something off someone, you talk polite and you get what you want, don't you? So just to show you that I can come in here and record, miss, right, because you were being rude, I will do that, miss. Okay, you're going to professional standards and you're going to get retrained, you, because you were very rude. I don't think you should be on the job. I think officers like you were dangerous on the streets. Okay. Has any of you got the thin blue line on? The only jack, have you? No, see, you know, can I tell you this before you go? You, 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 a bit, I'm not being a nuisance. You were being sound, mate, I swear down, I can't spoil you. And that's what we need, mate. Sorry, I'm pointing, I've just told her off for that. Right, listen, listen, we need police officers like you. Right? <laughs> but we don't need tyrants like Miss McGinley over there. And I am going to report you. Believe, believe me. I've already got uh, court cases outstanding with other police forces. And this is the reason we come, because of tyrants like yourself, miss. Fair enough. You shouldn't be in the job, you're dangerous. Do you know you wear that union flag with the thin blue line? I see none of you have got that on. We class that as a gang badge and I respect you for not having that on. <laughs> what, what I've been told, I'm going to leave you with this, right? What we've been told, right? I want to get both of you in shot. What we've been told, right, is... I'm going to wait at least finish with his radio. I'm aware of that. Do you have a thing on me? Can I tell you this? Yeah. Right? So, what we found, right, is um, when asked why police officers are using, uh, wearing that defaced union flag with a thin blue line, it's for officers that have fallen. Now, I've just read that, and we don't want no police or anyone dead, right? That's yeah. not what we want. But why don't, you, why don't you wear something on that uniform, right, to represent the people that's died in police custody? I don't know. I don't know what the answer Can you answer that, miss? Just a normal cop. Right? So, do you know that I'm not chewing on the year? I'm going to research it again. In the 1800s, this goes back to the 1800s, and it's a law that your uniform should be kept in the condition it was given to you. And putting them flags on, I appreciate that you haven't got them on, is not acceptable. Have you got a comment to make about that? No, no, I'd just like to ask you, if you came here in a vehicle... Why? I'm just, I'm just curious. That Does it matter? No. No, no come just, on the train. Sorry? Come on the train. Come on the train, no bother. In that case, I'll leave you to it, mate, okay? Right. But if I did come in a vehicle, what would it matter? Nothing. You want to try and solicit me for details? I'm not that daft enough to come in a vehicle. Because I know that you want to get details, so why would I come? 
in a vehicle. I don't drive you anywhere. But but can I ask you a question, though? Listen, you've been sound. Let me ask you one question, and I'll go. Oh well, I'm going to stay then. I'm going to stay. Just one question, and I'll go and leave you. Why did you want to know if I, if I was in a vehicle? Sorry? If, I'm, if you know that I'm doing a lawful activity, why do you want my vehicle, if I had one, right, to get my details? If I, why do you want my details if I'm doing a lawful activity? That's what I'm saying about the police, man. No okay, much. well, I'm going to sit here and I'm going to enjoy myself. Right, thank you very much. Thank you. So that's how we deal with that, guys. You know, um, telling me that I can't record in, um, you know, a normal member. Well, I'm, <laughs> I'm not normal, but... You know, um, a majority of the public would take that as gospel. You know what I mean? They're not police at all. You know, the um, police stuff. So would you say, guys, that is impersonating a police officer? That I've been locked up for, by the way. Arrested for. So, guys, I am going to pause. Do I know you? Pardon? Why would I do that? You're just a stranger. Well, you're on the police premises. Right, and how are you? Hey, I'm a detention officer of Norfolk Police. Okay, stay back a bit though. So you're not a police officer? No. Okay. And you want me to identify myself? I do, yes, please. I wouldn't. I'd like to stay anonymous. Well, what are you doing on police property? Well, I've come for a look about. Well, you, don't need, you haven't got any rights to look about. Of course, so I have got, leave the property. Oh, yeah, I've got it. I've got rights to be here, yeah? No, this is Sir, please just stay back, please. Please stay back. Here's a virus going about, isn't there? Um. I am willing to engage with you, sir. Well, clearly not. Yeah. Well, of course I'm I am. I'm trying to have a conversation with you. I'm asking you to leave the premises. You, you haven't got the authority to do that, though, sir. Carry on that way, please. You haven't got the authority. Please stay Do-do-do. back. Just stay. Maintain two metres distance, please. Walking, no. Oh, no. Please maintain your two metres. You are not allowed on this property. I just want to have a look. I want, no. I want to ask. Please maintain. Do not touch me. That's assault. And I will defend myself. OK, that's fine. You're right? Alone. Do not touch me. Stay back. Stay premises. back. That's Stay back. Asking. Stay back. Okay. I've got implied rights of access, sir. I will, like I said, yeah, I am more than willing to engage with you if you be civil. If you be civil, I will be civil, sir. I'd like to speak to a police officer if possible. I'll get you off, don't worry. Thank you. Please, please. You haven't done that, nah, nah, nah. Oh, yeah. it's, it's life and death. You should know better than that. Right, it's David, the attention officer. At uh, Athena House, I've got an uh, intruder on the property. Intruder? Yeah, on the car park. I'd like somebody to come and give a help assistance. I can't believe you've done that, 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 that. Yeah, they're on the uh, car park outside. Gosh, he's down that, that, that. Yeah, detention officer. I'm going to go to reception now. I'm going to go to reception now, sir, because I feel like you are dangerous. You know, I've confronted him and he's filming me now. I was filming before you before you arrived. I was filming beforehand, yeah. The police vehicle. I'll speak to them if you want. Sorry? Yes, they were filming camera vans, yeah. Yeah. Mark police vehicles I was uh, having a look at, sir. You were looking, filming inside. Yeah, the mark, the marked vehicle. You've got your vehicles to look at, sir. All right. Of course, they are pay taxes. The yours, I'm man. The yours, I'm man. I've got implied rights of access. You haven't. Of course I have. I've got implied rights of access. Otherwise, I've got I... Going. Have a car. Well, well, okay. How are we going? All right. Come on. It'd have been safer to go that way though, wouldn't it, Dave? Is it, Dave? Really? Is yeah, it? it is, Dave, yeah. How did I know that, Dave? Yeah, I told you. You never told me. I can't believe you phoned 999 for that, though, Dave. Yeah. That is, I just you, you, some assistance, that was the quickest way of getting it, wasn't it? Well, 101. Yeah. Wouldn't 101. So, are you gonna are you gonna stand and engage with me? What do you want to talk about? I, do, I, I want to talk about... What What's your role? Nothing to do with that. Nothing to do with you, well, my role. Right. Do you want me to tell There's you what? To... I'll tell you what then, right? I'm going to be open and transparent with you, yeah, right? Not, turn I am now. Face, eh? I'm going to be open and transparent. I'm going to be open and transparent with you. It's not in your face. Put it down and we'll talk to you. 
Uh, right, listen, do you want me to be open and transparent or not? No. I'm not interested, B. All right? Because you obviously are, because you're studying it. Well, I'm going to go and back and have a look at the um, police fans then. I would like to stand and engage with you, though. For if that I'm... reason? Because I just want to ask you a few questions. Is it on the Facebook and YouTube? No, yeah, I'm you not. Are. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. That's why you said, yeah, I didn't want to get no police um, mark driver vehicles. I'm not a hit one antagonise you, you know. Right. Okay, I'll leave you with it. All right, come on, this way. Yeah. This way, come you'll, on. You'll leave me with what? Are you going to talk to me then? Yeah, I've got electric to go back to. Come on. You've got what? Electric to go back to. So are you going to talk to me or not? I can't talk to you. What are you going to talk to me for? Well, if you're not going to talk to me, I may as well just go back in there. I'd like what? to talk to a PC but, or, a, or a sergeant. About? I want to talk about police corruption. No, I don't. Corruption. What I want to talk about, no, what I want to talk about is, right, listen, and I don't want to say no, no, listen to me, please. I don't want to say no police officer or members of the public die or murdered doing the job, right? And I understand that the police wear this Union Jack with a thin blue line, yeah? yeah. To represent, a, to represent um, fallen colleagues, yeah? But my question is this. Why can't the police wear something on the uniform, maybe he's beside that badge, to represent the people that's died in police custody? There hasn't been that many dying. There hasn't been that many dying? There isn't that many dying, Dave. There's more, there's more people who die in police custody not, than there is. Yes, there is, Dave. No. And you're a detention officer, Dave. It's a public building. I'd like to come in, Dave, please. No, we, we, Dave, let me come in. Just let me come in, Dave, please. You said you were going to engage with me, and you're not. Why do you lie? I'm not lying with you. I'm you trying to, to listen, I'm trying to build a bridge with the police, right? And you were just wagging. You, you, you were just wagging. You? you were just wagging on the bridge, though. So, you know, because you stood lying, mate. I'm lying to you. You know, you tell me there's no deaths in North Yorkshire. There hasn't been any deaths in North Yorkshire for a while. How long? Right? How long? I can't tell you exactly. I can tell you, because I've already, I've already um, done my research I before mean, I've kicked. Yes. And there's been a lot of deaths, Dave, and you know the has. Yes, the has. Right I'll across, right, right, uh, right across the board, right, right across, across the board. The board right? Put it down. What I mean, what I mean by because North York is quite, quite um, geographically, it's massive, isn't it? Yeah, it's quite a big area. Yeah. It's the biggest massive area in the country. In the country, yeah. what bigger than uh, Manchester? Is it? Area-wise. Right, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. What do you spe what do you know Inspector Sarah Sanderson? Well I do a lot, is there other What do you think of Sarah Sanderson? Nothing. You don't think nothing of her? She's not very professional, Dave. Dave, can I ask you one more question? I'm gonna get out of your hair. Where are you going here? <laughs> <laughs> no, listen then. I'm gonna get out I'm gonna get out of your hair first then. On, one more question. So there's no point me asking then, is there? No. So why did you why did you come and engage with me then if you don't even want to engage? You, because I believe you're up to no good. I'm up to no good. I've told you what I'm up to, mate. Yeah. I wouldn't come to a police station and be up to no good, would I? So what can I be up to know? looking in a speed camera van then? What well, no why, why what purpose are you looking at that? If your purpose is custody related to death. Because it was what? there, because it was there, and I just thought I'd have a, it just sparked my it sparked my uh, curiosity at all. Oh, okay. That's all. So, just, so you know, the question I wanted to ask you. Then. Sorry, say that again. Nosy busybody. Then. Well, you could say that. I'm a journalist. I'm a journalist, and that's right, what we're paid to do. Then. Listen, are the police coming to engage with me or not? Yeah. They are. Yeah. So shall I wait for them? So, I'm not going to get your car on for them, right? So I'm not here for that, right? All right. Yeah. Is that fair? See, I'm not here to antagonise you, you know, Dave. I well, think you've, you're I think me and you, I think me and you have got off on the wrong foot, mate. Well, we got off the wrong foot because you were on the wrong side of the game, weren't you? No, we got off on the wrong side of the foot. Because you should have gone to reception first and asked permission. I tried to, but the inner door was locked, yeah, mate. So, got a there for. so listen, me and you got off on the wrong foot, and I think why we did was because you tried to give me orders that like you haven't no, got the power to I do. Tried to give me orders, mate. And you did, you did, you told me to leave, and I you did. didn't have that power. You haven't got that power to do that, Dave, and that's why I mean you got off on the wrong foot because yeah, right. you because you start taking major resentments. Yeah, sure. But listen, will you ask if there's somebody in there who could who could come out and try and engage me? Yeah. Dave, I'm only going to come in after you anyway. Can can you ask if someone will come out and talk to me, please? Thank you. 
I bet you don't, though. So, guys, there you go. That's Dave, the detention officer. Now, that's Dave, the detention officer. So, if that's Dave, the detention officer, you can imagine what the police are like in here, can't you? Can't you, guys? So, guys, apparently, the police are coming to uh, uh, engage with me. So, what I'm... Oi, oi, guys, sick, no rights back. So... What we've done is we put a little video together from um Torbs' best bits from my early audits. Um, like my fucking, I've done my second, third, fourth, fifth, things like that. I've done. Um, so I've done the best bits out of them. I'm gonna leave the link to all them videos. Um, so if you haven't seen the full video, the links are gonna be there for you in the uh, description, just down there. Um. So the first one on this video is. Um, Clough Road in Hull. That was my third, one, two, three, yeah, third, third audit. I'd went with Natural, uh, born serial killer, and I'd been watching Natural and like leaving comments, um, on his content before I'd even picked the camera up. And that day when I picked him up, I felt a bit starstruck, you know, guys, looking at that fucking fucking out, man. You know what I mean? I felt a bit star. I didn't tell him, no, or I couldn't tell him. See, his editor went a bit bigger than what it already is, and we don't want that, do we, guys? Um, so, yeah, it was uh, the Euros final. And uh, we went to Clough Road. The reason we went to Clough Road was because Live Free uh, had been... Um, it had it had sex and fifty misused and abused on him. I, I think three times, if I'm not mistaken, three different on three different occasions, the uh, misused and abused section fifty on him. Uh, and they had uh, they had on one of them occasions, or if not two of them occasions, I'm not sure. At least one used now Yorkshire was with him, so me and Natural went. Um and that was the outcome of the video. Now what yeah you, what you seen was um Inspector uh Natural Natural's class um natural nicknamed him um Inspector Wiggy um because if you look at his hair you'll clock it um and what Inspector Wiggy was trying to do was misuse and abuse section one of pace and section 43 he couldn't he couldn't choose between which one he was saying section one of pace or we could do section 43 do you know what i mean that that statement alone just tells you that he's fucking uh misusing and abusing legislation Um, what i will tell you though is he didn't misuse and abuse any because me and natural didn't allow that to happen um what i will say is when i got home i did try to form 101 on more than one occasion about four different occasions on the fourth occasion i took my complaint it went to professional standards guys and it got uh, upheld um and there was another two i believe another two officers that came out on another no another one asian sorry another one came out um he wouldn't identify himself him so they did get um reprimanded um and the bloke i got his number somewhere uh direct line to him and was saying that basically i can't understand why uh Umbersad police are doing that because they're being told by us that they shouldn't be doing that and they should be leaving people like you alone so basically uh the complaint got um upheld the next video on here is middle spread at the covid center and now that was only my second order and i got arrested so as you've seen the first officer turned up pc burgess Basically, um, I tried to get my details after he asked me what had happened, and I explained, and said no, and then asked him, do I have to, and he said no, which we already knew, don't we, guys? Um, and then the other copper um, that I nicknamed uh, PC Bacon Chops um, turns up on blow lights, goes straight into the COVID uh, site and talks to the staff, comes out, I offended him, not on purpose, but I, I basically told him about his uh, union flag with a pen blue line. And my granddad fought for that flag. So why, why are you defacing it? Um, he took offence to it. His ego got in the way. Asked me for my details. Wouldn't give him an, um So he arrested me. I'd already told him that what it is. Everything that um, they're alleging. I've got it all on video. And that hasn't happened. Um basically though that pc bear just should have jumped in and said do you know what do you know what i mean but he never he allowed him oh he allowed him a fucking uh brutalize me 
and take my rights away. So I put a civil claim in against them. Um, and where we're at that is they're not taking liability. So we're taking them to court. I can't say too much more about that, guys, because it's an ongoing case. So I can't say too much more, but that's where we are with that. The next one was Sunderland. I believe that was my fourth audit. Um, and I went with audit and all. Uh, good, good kid. Met audit and all. Um, as you can see in the video, I asked the uh, three officers have come to us and I've asked, what should I call you? Because they do say, don't let there was, uh, what's your details? Uh, I'd just like to know what I'm talking to. So I said that back. Um, and he said, call me anything. So I said, bacon chops. And um, I'd already said to that female, though, you know, I, I, I was using her terminology. And um, when I said to her, basically, um, in the current climate, people go around video, basically. And then he tried to use it, didn't he? 666, the devil tried to use it. Um, and current climate, it was boiling that day. I said, I know the climate, it's boiling. He was like, no. Nah. You know, that was a good video that I enjoyed enjoyed that day. And then me and Audit and all actually went on to me. Um, we went to Naturals, went Natural, um, Duo Public and uh, Plodder. To Plodder, not to Plod. Uh, it was an alright day that actually. The next one on the list is Wrecker. You know, I went with a lad who lived next door in the next door, uh, in the next block of flats to me at the time. And he asked, can I come with you just to see what it's like? And that, that's my most viewed video, guys. And I was telling them that I'd take them for lawful redress. Uh, basically, I enjoyed that video. Um, it was a good video. Again, the link is down there. If you haven't seen that video, it's down there. Press the link and go and watch it. The next one, South Shields. Um, South Shields, what was she called? Uh, PC McGinley. She was a right snotty cow, wasn't she? Um... And then what I haven't added on that video though is another um, female. She was right in my face. It was COVID times as well. She was right in my face. I put a complaint in against them. Again, eventually they took my complaint, um, and they didn't they didn't uphold it. I said basically that uh, the, the um, done everything correctly, apart from Miss McGinley. Maybe you've been a bit rude. Uh, the inspector said, move it. Um, so that was South Shields. The next one was Detention Officer Dave, man. Again, i done three, three audits that day, and uh, every audit, it was a good day, content that. Uh, but that was Detention Officer Dave, and he was off it. He was off it, Detention Officer Dave, man. I had to buzz off him, man. I had to buzz off him. And here we go, Mrs. Torbinator's in, in the area. I want Mrs. Torbs, you know what I mean? So, but, Mrs. Tobbs was there with detention officer Dave. He'd have, uh, he wouldn't have got away with that kind of carry on. She'd have put it on his toes. <coughs> wouldn't you, baby? Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, that was detention officer Dave again. Just down there, you'll find the link if you haven't seen that video. That was a good video, that man. <laughs> He's in the yard, though, guys. Listen, this is so backward, the yard. If it, if it was me, yeah, they were in the back. He's in the backyard in the police station, phoning 999 for police assistance. Because he wanted police assistance because he was telling me to leave and I wouldn't leave. So he thought he'd phone 999. Why don't you just go in there and get from your colleagues, man? Rupert. Because if I phone 999 or you phone 999 or something like that, we'd have been told off. Do you know what I mean? But it's alright for them to um, abuse the 999 system. Do you know what I mean? Life or death, mate. Put the phone down. Yo. Clarence. Yeah, so, um, yeah. One, two three four five six all six of them videos i've got to admit i did enjoy making them um and i think that's turbinator at his best he is some more that i could have put in like um the new gasoline gate said one i could have put them in um but yeah um Torb's best bits man guys i hope you enjoyed the video because i loved making them so listen, what we're going to do is we're going to split, we're going to bounce and we'll catch it all on the rebound. Until then guys, please stay safe and be lucky. Respect as always. You know what goes when Torbinator's about and now I'm getting fucking done in now. So I'm going to go. Peace.